A 25 year old bull rider from Missouri is dead after being trampled during a rodeo uh, event there at the National Western Stock Show. I'm Britt Marino, and we do start off with this really troubling news. Mason Lowe died after he was bucked off that bull last night. Our Tori Mason is live for us at the National Western Complex. And Tori, this is just a reminder of how dangerous this sport really is. Absolutely, Britt. Mason Lowe had been riding for seven years and was ranked 18th in the world. But it doesn't matter how experienced you are, this is still one of the most dangerous sports in the world. Lowe tweeted this video of him riding last weekend. The 25 year old was killed during last night's PBR shootout while riding the bull hard times. A witness told CBS4 Lowe was bucked off hard times. When he was on the ground, the bull's back legs stomped Lowe in the chest. He was able to stand up and take a few steps before grabbing his chest and collapsing. In a 2017 interview with Springfield's KOLR, a reporter asked Lowe if he wanted to do this for the rest of his life. He told her bull riding is what he loves and it's all he knows. My dad and uncles used to ride and, and when I started up, it's we had a few dairy calves that were a little, real little. My dad held me on a couple of them. And, uh, once I got a little older, they kind of held me on for a little bit, and a year later, they, they let me hit the dirt and said if I was going to hit the dirt and if I got back up and wanted to get on, that's what I wanted to do, and I've been doing it ever since. It's just their job. They love it. I mean, they, they know the dangers. They, they, I don't know how you reconcile it, but they, they, know what, they know what it is, and that's just their job, and that's what they eat and breathe and love. Now the finals are still scheduled for 7 p.m. There's going to be a tribute for Lowe here at the stock show tonight as well as a fundraiser for his family. But based on that interview you just heard, I think it's safe to say that he died doing what he loves. We're live in Denver, Tori Mason covering Colorado first. It's a sad day. Thank you, Tori.